Hi everyone, I just wanted to make a very quick announcement to everybody in the company. It looks like things are finally getting back to normal. I certainly hope you haven't been too impacted by the COVID epidemic, but it looks like the government is now allowing restrictions to be lifted. And so people are coming back to work, schools are going back, and our cleaning should get back to normal. So I wanna make a couple of uh, points uh, with you while I've got you uh, all together. Number one, a lot of our clients are now asking for additional cleaning with touch points, etc. But they're also asking for time reports as they want to know how long the cleaners are spending on site. So it's critical that we can actually uh, produce those reports. Uh, I want to make it very clear that we are not clock watching. If we're giving you 10 hours, say, uh, a week to do a job, and you get the job done in eight hours and the customer is delighted, great. More power to you, we're certainly not concerned. What we're concerned about primarily is, is the customer happy with the cleaning service that we are providing? Is he getting a fresh and clean workplace each and every morning? If you can do that in less time than we're allocating you, that's great. Good luck to you, we'd love to give you more work. However, if there is a problem, that's the first place that Albert will look, David will look, and I will look. We always look, is the cleaner putting the time in on the site required to do the job properly? So from June 1, which is next Monday, it is going to be compulsory for you to log in and log out using your QR code on your site. If for any reason at all you cannot log in or you cannot log out, you must notify your area manager, and that's normally going to be either David or Albert uh, or, your, um, or your supervisor. It is critical that you log in and log out. Now, if we don't get a log in and a log out for a shift, we won't be paying you for that shift, okay? So I've told you, it's very clear, you need to log in, you need to log out. What happens if there's a problem, a technical problem, and there's a Wi-Fi issue or a GPS issue, then you must take a photo of this and put it on WhatsApp so we know the time that it was put on. And then Albert or David will go out and sort out what the problem is. Maybe we need to move this to another location where you get a better signal. But there is no excuse from June 1 to not log in and not log out. Again, I say, if you can't log in using the app, take a photo, put it on your app. That's all for now. I'm glad to see everybody's getting back to working and earning the money they need to, uh, need to earn. If you have any problems at all or any questions, please contact me directly.